will spend the rest of his life in prison. Jurors spent about an hour and a half deliberating, and during closing arguments, the defense of Farrington led Kozak on. They said he had diminished responsibility at the time of the shooting. When she broke up with him, he didn't have the mental skills skill, excuse me, to deal with it because he had mental disorders. Prosecutors said he doesn't suffer from any mental disorders, and he wanted to kill Farrington because she bruised his ego. Farrington's family broke down in tears and hugged each other wearing T-shirts that say, Andrea, justice has been served. Yes, I feel justice has been served. Nothing's going to bring her back. But at least it gives us that comfort of knowing we will never have to deal with that man again. Well, I'm always surprised by a first-degree uh, murder uh, a conviction verdict. Uh, I thought there were some mitigating factors. Obviously, the jury uh, disagreed. But uh, no, I thought there were some mitigating factors uh, that were involved that led to this situation.